Well, I'm joined here by Exeter Chiefs assistant coach Steve Salvin after his size magnificent performance over Wasps this afternoon, running out 84 0 victors in London. Well, Steve, you must be delighted with that performance. Yeah, yeah, we um, certainly second half we felt um, there's a couple of areas in the first half we didn't look, look after particularly well, particularly around the breakdown, but um, felt second half we put that right and uh, we were much more fluid. So, uh, yeah, really happy. Indeed, you mentioned being a lot more fluid in the second half. I mean, some of the attack was uh, was quite spectacular. Some of your outside backs really getting an opportunity to shine. Yeah, yeah we, they, look, they look really clear in terms of exactly what their roles were. And I think that's when teams tend to flourish and be at their very, very best. You know, we're a team that likes to play with layers and you could see that in the second half. But I think that was aligned with the speed of ball that we were able to generate in the second half. We just struggled with that a little bit in the first half. So those two things combined together and we scored some excellent tries. And you mentioned struggling slightly in the first half. I mean, you've got to give some credit to Wall State. They really fronted up, didn't they? Yeah, absolutely. We, you know, we knew they would. We, we, didn't expect, um, we didn't expect anything else but them to be, to be, to be full throttle right from the start. And that's exactly what they were. You know, for the first 20, 25 minutes, um, the game was ebbing and flowing in favour of both teams at different times. So, as I said, it, uh, we knew we'd have to we knew we'd have to fight to break them down. Unfortunately, that's what we were able to do. But uh, I think second half the dam broke a little bit, and we were able to score some really, really nice tries. Indeed, we could pick out many players who performed exceptionally uh, this afternoon. But I'm going to pick uh, Kate Zachary. Obviously, uh, just. Uh, Unbelievable that she can just switch position like that from the back row into the centre. So versatile. Uh, how key is she to the side? Well, there's not another player in the world that could do what she does. Uh, as like you said, to be able to be to be world class in two different positions, um, and one of those positions being the forwards and the other one being the backs is such a unique thing to have. Um, and again, she was just unbelievable today. And you know, we started her in the back row this week. She's played in the, played in that 13 channel for the last two weeks. Because of a bump we got, we ended up with a back in the 13 and she was just exceptional again. So we are very, very lucky to have someone that talented. And you went for a new combination in midfield. Obviously, Robin Wilkins yeah. uh, making her first start with Liv McGum playing outsider in the inside centre shirt. Uh, how pleased are you with the way those two gelled? Yeah, really good, actually. We um, we, we thought we were getting more of a 12 with Liv, but obviously Liv's, Liv's um, shone in that 10 channel over the past four or five weeks. Um, but what we have clearly got in that position, and we've not had certainly while I've been at the club, is that depth in that 10 spot. So to have that depth is great, but the fact that we can put both of them on the field at the same time likewise gives us a slightly different avenue we can go down to in terms of our attack game. So uh, I thought Rob was really good today, and likewise I thought seeing Liv play at 12 was really exciting as well, so pleased with how they went. And obviously, uh, to mention another back, Claudia McDonald, uh, talking of being versatile as well, uh, playing at Scrum Half for the first time for the Chiefs this season. How pleased are you with how she went? Yeah, solid. Yeah, very, very solid. You know, they're, they're so different wing and 15. Uh, sorry, wing and, uh, and Scrum Half in terms of, well, both from an attack and a defence perspective. So, a bit like Kate, to flip between the two is a, is a real, real unique skill and it's certainly something that Claudia's got. Um, so yeah, we'll, we'll have a chat about what we, we do with club moving forward, but certainly a very solid performance at nine today. Well, thanks, Steve. Well played today. Cheers.